over a million years, lions have ruled the African savanna. They sit at the top of the food chain. Because with their tremendous power, superior leaping ability, and extraordinary teamwork, Lions aren't afraid to take on anything. The lion, king of the beasts. Seen like it's never been seen before. From the inside out. Through the eyes of I, Predator. It's mid-September in East Africa. The dry season. These 12 adult lions and six cubs live together in a pride, an extended family that stays and hunts together for life. This season is particularly hot and dry and much of the lion's prey is beginning to migrate to greener pastures, which means fewer hunting opportunities. Each lion needs over five kilograms of meat a day, about 8,000 calories, and with fewer chances at a meal, this pride can't afford a botched hunt. The average lioness can reach a top speed of 54 kilometers per hour. But the strikers, the fastest and most agile lions in the pride, can reach speeds of over 60 kilometers per hour. One striker races past one of the flushers and launches into an attack. She does this with incredibly engineered claws. Each paw has four sharp forward-facing claws and a backward-facing dew claw, each sitting in its own ball and socket joint, independently suspended. So as the buffalo tries to buck the lioness, she's able to continually adjust her hold and that's no easy task. This lioness is being dragged with an unbelievable three Gs of force. It's like the claws on each paw are trying to hold on to a rocket just after launch. Soon, reinforcements arrive. Two more lions jump on the buffalo's back and use their combined weight to try to bring it down. The 770 kilogram buffalo is now carrying three lions, weighing more than 400 kilograms. One lioness digs in with her massive canines, while another covers the buffalo's nose and mouth with her own mouth. Within 15 seconds, the buffalo experiences the onset of oxygen deprivation. He panics. This incites a spike in heart rate and rapid body movement, which rather than conserving what little oxygen he has left, eats it up. The buffalo starts to lose consciousness. His muscles relax. Finally, it's over. In a few months, the new resident male's cubs are born. Someday, if they're lucky, they'll grow up to lead prides of their own. Just like someday they'll be challenged by younger males for those prides.
such is life on the savannah. In an ongoing story, millions of years old.